Good morning, good morning, good morning, good afternoon, good evening, no matter what time it is that you're watching this. My name is Clarissa Young and I'm your Fab Motivator. That's F-A-B. I help other guys and girls find acceptable balance when it comes to esteem, health, wellness, and prosperity. I'd like to thank you so much from the bottom of my heart for liking, for commenting, for sharing this video and joining me along my journey. If you're looking for me, I'm here. Every Monday, every Friday, and every Saturday at 8.30 a.m. Eastern Standard Time. I also upload the videos on YouTube on my YouTube channel. So please be sure to go and like and subscribe to my YouTube channel, which is Clarissa Young. Good morning, good morning, good morning, good morning, good morning. It is Saturday. On Saturday, we work out in our chair. So will we be working out in our chair? So make sure you have your chair. Make sure you have your energy. Remember... Only thing I can see is me. So I need your heart, I need your love, I need your comments, I need your energy this morning. Good morning, good morning, good morning. Facebook and updated some stuff on me. The the I guess they made the, the, the word in clear. All right. Good morning, Cynthia. Good morning, good morning, good morning. Good morning, Justin. Good morning, good morning, good morning. It's gonna be harder for me to see the stuff now, Facebook. All right, good morning, Robin Knight. Good morning, good morning. There is a timer going on in the background. The purpose of the timer is to help keep us going. We're doing the same workout that we did yesterday in the chair. I didn't show much mercy for us in the chair. We're gonna try out some new things. Wanna make sure that your chair is stable. Your chair is stable, that it's not wobbling and moving around, especially when we get to doing our planks. Yes, guys, we are still doing planks in the chair. Flat Tommy 2019, we're pushing it. Do me a huge favor, hit the bottom left share button. Good morning, Betty. Bottom left share button. We're gonna get ready to warm up in our chair really quick.
Rep one of ten. Set one.
Thank you. 
Nice.
Mas bem.
evening. No matter what time of the day it is that you're watching this, my name is Clarissa Young, and I'm your Fab Motivator. That's F A B. I help other women find acceptable balance when it comes to esteem, health, wellness, and prosperity. I'd like to thank you so much from the bottom of my heart for liking, for commenting, for sharing this video, and joining me along my journey. <laughs> I'm laughing at you, Miss Ronnie. If you look at or Miss Ramona said it. If if you're looking for me, I'm here every Monday, every Friday, and every Saturday at 8:30 a.m. Eastern Standard Time. I also upload the videos on YouTube on my YouTube channel, which is Clarissa Young. So please be sure to go and like and subscribe to my YouTube channel, which is Clarissa Young. I, I have a hard time saying it. Like I say, I help other guys and girls but really I help women and the guys come along and I'm here to support and encourage you guys too but girl power <laughs> I've been trying to force it on myself to say guys and girls and ladies and men and it just doesn't roll right as I help other women find acceptable balance and so it is what it is right you have your calling and your calling is your calling at the end of each video I like to give a little bit of tips of motivation and encouragement um, first of all let me say that chair workout did not sleep. That chair workout did not sleep. For anybody that don't know what I mean, mean, if you did it, you brought it. If you did it, you brought it. Sometimes we look at being in a chair as not good enough or, or less than. Let me tell you, the chair is beautiful because the chair takes some of that gravity off of you. And so that's when you can really work and you can push yourself a little bit harder because you don't have the unforgiving gravity that's holding you back that's hurting your knees and that's doing all that stuff good morning Shantae sus good morning and so um when I tell you my abs are on fire this morning abs are on fire that was a really really good workout how did you guys feel how did you guys feel let's ask how did y'all feel but science said that was great Chayelle said that was great Yes, yes, yes. Ronnie got a sweat. Melody said exactly that part. <laughs> All right, guys. Um, I don't really have a word for you this morning except to keep pushing. Keep pushing, keep trying, keep believing in yourself. You can do this one day at a time, one step at a time. Um, just make sure every day you just try a little bit more, you go a little bit harder, and you stay unique to yourself. You stay true to yourself. You stay real to yourself. You stay motivating yourself. At the end of the day, you have to encourage yourself. You have to speak life to yourself. You have to be positive to yourself. Nobody is going to support you the way that you support you. And so, you have to believe me. Wow. I just realized it, that this is a song. Yeah, you. You are powerful. Yeah, you. Like, this is one of my favorite songs. Beautiful Flower by India Ari. I wish Facebook would just let me play the song and not give any issues, but they won't. But when you get a chance, go to YouTube and go put Beautiful Flower. And she just saying you're beautiful. You're resilient. You're powerful. You can do everything. Yeah, you. Sometimes we like, who are you talking about? Me? I'm the awesome one. I'm the great one. I'm the one that can help myself. I'm the one that can help others. Yeah, you. Yeah, you. That's a word for you right there. Go take the time. Beautiful Flower by India Ari. And go listen and go meditate on that song. If you find that you just need something to help you with some strength, you need something to help you to believe in yourself, go listen to the song. Go listen to the song. Remember, I'm always big on affirmations. We speak affirmations all the time, but unfortunately, a lot of times, the affirmations are negative. I don't eat right. I don't like to exercise. I can't do this diet thing. I just keep giving. Like, those are affirmations, but however, they're negative ones. And so, we want to make sure that we take our words and flip it into positive, even when you do not believe it at that moment. Continue to speak it, but have a positive posture. That means your body is saying, even though I don't believe it, I'm going to stand firm. My voice is going to be solid. It's going to be strong, and I'm going to say it strong, and I'm going to have hope. I'm going to have hope that, that I don't see it, that I have a God above that can help me to make sure these things come out right. And so even though I don't enjoy exercising, you get up and you say, I love to exercise. Exercising comes so easy to me. Exercising comes so free to me. I feel 
great when I exercise. Exercise is my first nature. And you just continue to say that to yourself and eventually you'll walk in it. Eventually you'll walk in it. God is not gonna put something in your mind for you to do and your thoughts for you to do if you don't have the ability to do it. That's businesses, that's relationships, that's believing in yourself, that's all of it. It's not gonna give you an ideal, a thought of something that you could do if you can't do it, okay? And, and if it's something that's inevitable, like maybe you think you wanna fly like a bird, <laughs> maybe you can't exactly fly like a bird, but maybe there's something that you need to create that's gonna help you. Like I'm reading TDJ books and I'm gonna get up out of here. He said God didn't make trees. I mean, excuse me, God didn't make tables. He didn't make chairs. He didn't make these things. He knew that we was going to need them, but he didn't make these things, meaning he gave us wood. He gave us the wood to shape and to form it into that. But he knew you was going to need a chair. If, if he didn't know that you had the ability to do it, then you would plant seeds and chairs would just grow. They would, chairs would just grow naturally, but however, he gave you the wood that could be created into so many different things. He gave you thoughts. He gave you words. He gave you visions. He gave you insight that can be created into so many things, but it's up to you to believe and to take a little bit of planning and do it. Okay, guys? I love you, love you all so much. I said I didn't have a word. I guess he did. <laughs> I love you, love you, love you so much. I will see us on Monday. Until October, we still doing this flat tummy challenge. Like I said, either we're going to have six packs or we're going to have six packs up under some rolls. But either way to go, the core is going to be strong. The core is the most important, most important um, part of our body. The core is what helps with everything. Walking upstairs, getting in and out of your bed, standing up, bending down to pick up something. Like core is everything. If you find that you struggle, so if I said it the other day, if you find... If you find when you get out your bed, you laying in the bed this morning, and you gotta do one of them, <laughs> your core is too weak. You have to strengthen your core. You should be able to come straight up. You should be able to come straight up, okay? And so that means we gotta work on this core, okay? All right, guys. Love you, love you, love you so much. Enjoy your day, okay? Talk to you later. Bye-bye.